is how 80-year-old Nellie spends most mornings. I feel better in the kitchen than any place else. Other than bed, sometimes I'm happy to be, get into bed <laughs> and fall out. <laughs> but life at Willow Lodge wasn't always this rosy. In fact, when Betty Matheson assessed the health of her residents several years ago, she was shocked by what she found. Our rate of depression here at Willow Lodge was over 50%. I think it was close to 60%. And the instance of little or no activity was probably similar, about 60%. That was a real eye-opener for us. Matheson used measurement tools developed by InterI, an international research collaborative and supported by the Canadian Institute for Health Information. Quality indicators allow her to monitor how individual patients are doing and how her nursing home compares to others. We know that there is a lot of depression among the elderly and a lot of that comes from you know, losing their family, losing their friends, outliving their so-called usefulness. Where do we start? Well, we looked at medications, uh, we looked at activities. We started looking at the residents as an individual and what would interest them. If a resident is um, lashing out or is um, upset, why are they upset? What's causing that behavior? Is it because they're not getting enough attention, so therefore they're lonely? And lots of times that's all it is. We have a couple of staff that bring their dogs to work every day. We've had, we have cats, we have numerous birds, uh, we, we have sweet treat and tea on Friday afternoons where we break out the china cups and now Nellie does the baking for it. <laughs> Without the data and quality indicators, Matheson says they would never have known what they were dealing with. Getting all this information and then doing something about it and then seeing the results getting better is just a, a, a wonderful uh, experience. Depression rates at the home have fallen by half. A lot of that stuff is in your heart and you think that, you know, you're, you're doing the right thing, but the data proves we're doing the right thing.